Hey guys, thank you for coming to my channel. Today is going to be a very interesting talk today. Very interesting talk today. But today I'm going to be talking about which fahas are best for after surgery, which fahas are best that if you have not had surgery, but you just want to mold, mold your body while you're exercising, or which fahas are better to actually just wear under your clothes. Okay, so these things, there, there are so many different ones that you can have, but I'm going to tell you the best. Okay, first like, comment, and subscribe, and we're going to go ahead and get to the video. Thank you. I am back. I know it has been a minute, but I am back. Uh, and another thing, y'all, I have put on some weight. We're going to talk about that in our next video because um, I want y'all to follow me on my lose weight journey because I have put on weight. And a lot of the weight, guys, if you are any of my dolls or, or have had a BBL, it goes right to your butt. Like it goes right to your butt. And if you gain too much weight, then it can still go all over. So don't get that twisted. Okay, but that's going to be the next video. We're going to go ahead and jump into this video right here. Uh, so please like, comment, and subscribe. And we're going to get into it right now. Okay, guys, we're going to go ahead and get into it right now. Now, first, you guys know that I am a affiliate for Snatch Bands. I believe that they have the best, the best garments, the best garments, the best undergarments, Fahas, for the uh, best results that you want. Um, it's really important to have the best garments to be able to get the results that you need, okay? Um, please use my code, Boss Lady, and it's the number seven. You can get major discounts using my discounts. This is like more than just the normal discounts that regular affiliates have because I have been with this company for quite a while now so i get more discounts now and i'm actually happy about that and if you want to uh, be a affiliate for that company as well um they do have different affiliate plans where you can get more money back for different affiliate plans um but let's go ahead and stay on the subject the first thing that we're going to talk about is which fahas are best for after surgery if you had any type of tummy tuck, lipo surgery, BBLs, however you want to, any type of plastic surgery, cosmetic surgery, these are your best top four right here, okay? The first one right here, okay, this one right here is called the Exquisite, okay? And the Exquisite, if you got any type of BBL, oh my gosh, it gives you the perfect butt lift. Butt lift is on point, on point it don't even matter with this one right here it, even if you did not have surgery if you just need a good butt lifter right there butt lifter on point like seriously it makes a big big difference um so you definitely want to consider the exquisite uh if you are just coming out of surgery for like your stage one uh something that gives you the compression but because you're bruised up um, it just don't squeeze you so tight because sometimes when you're bruising, y'all know how that bruising go. Um, so it gives you a little bit of, uh, wiggling air, uh, room to be able to move a little bit. Okay. So the exquisite would definitely be my number one. When you come out of surgery, don't wear them big old, big old fire highs that they're putting you in. If you had them in the United States, if you had any cosmetic surgery in the United States, they put you in these huge, huge oversized fire highs. Go ahead and downsize as soon as those wounds close. It's really important, okay? Uh, the exquisite is really good for just for coming. I actually put mine on like a day after because I couldn't do that. I needed that compression. I really did, okay? Um, this one here is for your stage two. This is called butt sizes too big. When I tell you butt sizes not too big. <laughs> <laughs> not butt sizes too too big it's called but two sizes bigger but two sizes bigger is the name of this one right here this one is really good for your second stage oh my god it shapes you so well this is one of my number ones um it gives you enough room the uh butt part is actually uh, uh breathable um i really, really and it gives enough compression to whereas it fits you well like it really feels good and it gives you the compression that is needed to go ahead and mold you in that particular shape everybody know that fajas and garments are meant to mold you that's why doctors give you fajas after you have your surgery or after you have your procedure you have to have some type of compression because it helps mold you okay uh this one right here like i said but two sizes bigger this is one of my number ones i love it i love it i love it you definitely want to get that um the third one right here 
Okay, this one have bones. So it has bones in, in, in it. So if you are looking to really snatch your stomach, this faja here is more like a waist trainer with a faja. You understand what I'm saying? So it, it, it snatches your stomach in completely. Like it really gives you way more compression. But that stomach ain't budging. It ain't budging. So it's, it's, it's more of like a really tough compression. But if you want that snatch stomach, this will be the faja for you. Um, if you want that snatch, snatch waist. Them bones, it keep you in place, baby. I, I do have this one as well. It, and honey, I'm going to have to start putting it back on because uh, I got to mold me again, y'all. I I, I got to mold me again. Y'all, we we got to talk. We, we really got to talk because... I, I got the mold me again, baby. But uh, so in, anyway, this is definitely for your extra, extra small waists. If somebody's looking for that extra, extra small waist, this is the faja for you right here. Uh, so if you just coming out of surgery or if you are in a dress and you need that extra small waist look, this one right here would definitely be it. But it has major compression in the stomach area. So make sure that you do understand that. Okay. The next thing that we're going to talk about is the ones that's best to wear under your clothes. Under your clothes. These are seamless garments that are really great to wear under your clothes. Or if you're going back to work after some type of surgery, these right here is really great to wear under your clothes um, just to be comfortable um, but still have that shape. This one right here is called the Miracle. It gives you a lot, a lot of of compression but it's not like the fajas but it's because it's seamless but it just makes sure that your shape completely right if you got a like a nice little thin dress that you don't want people to see that you actually have a garment on this one would be the one like this is a really really good faja uh well well garment that actually shapes your body and pull your body in where it's needed um and it actually gives you a really really good butt lift because it has a uh not a stretchable butt but it it it, it has a uh, no this one is a, a a breathable stretchable butt so it's like a mesh butt so it actually makes your butt come out to give you that shape that you actually need so i really love this one as well um this one is the next one here it actually come in shorts as well this one is in shorts so if you already have nice legs and you're really not trying to shape your legs but you want just that garment just to have you smooth out um and have that waist coming in this will be a good one if you just want if if you like wearing shorter like short shorts um this will be really good to wear under uh jeans if you are really just trying to get that good butt lift um and that really smooth look under your shirts this would definitely be the ones okay these are the two that i would recommend to wear under your clothes these are awesome now we have one more this one right here if you need a bra one so this is a seamless one it gives you the same amount of compression and the same look under your clothes but with lifted breasts lifted butt and a small waist so this one right here is actually if you don't want to wear a bra but you want to use this garment as a bra so this one is really good it gives you the compression y'all i wear these like i really wear these all the time okay but i gotta get back to my fajas i gotta get back to my fajas because i need a lot of compression because i need it to mow me back guys I need more molding when I work out. Okay, so I got to mold that on up. Um, but now we're going to go into the ones that actually, if you need to uh, go to work, if you want to go to work or you're just looking for a faja to basically give you that oomph for that day, I would have to tell you guys, the exquisite. The exquisite is the most comfortable comfortable with faja that you can go to bed in. Like you can really sleep in this guy in this faja, and it actually gives you the compression that's needed to continue to mold your body and give you that excellent butt lifted. Like, oh my gosh, I love the exquisite. Um, if you look on Snatch Man's the Exquisite and the Exquisite and uh But Two Sizes Bigger is actually the top selling fajas. And, and like those, those are really, really, really good. Now, some people are putting waist trainers on top of them for extra, 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 extra compression where you can't breathe. But a lot of people don't want to be uncomfortable. They want to be able to sleep. And I get that 100%. But some of these come with bands as well. So the bands already come with them. So you can wear them or you don't have to wear them. It's all your choice. It's all your choice. But these are excellent, excellent, 
excellent fajas that you can just put on after your surgery or whatever. Okay, now if you have not had surgery and you want to know what is the best garment for me to wear because a lot of women need to know like what's the best because a lot of people want the top garments. Like a lot of people's like, hey, now tell me what the top garments are so I can get the top because you want to mold your body the best. You want to look the best, right? So these, if you have not had surgery and you want to wear some type of faja or some type of garment just to give your, just to start molding your body or if you're going out one day or you're getting married or however you want to put it, whatever your plans are and you just want to wear this faja or this garment, I would definitely say, now, what, what the first thing I want to say is you can wear any one of them. Good night, mama. Good night, baby. You can actually wear any one of them. Any one of them is a plus. So it's going to make a difference on e either either one. Okay. Um, so, but I would recommend, okay, the exquisite, okay, would be one. Uh, but two sizes bigger would be two. Okay, and I would also recommend the first one of the of the uh uh shapeless wear. Of the seamless wear, of, of the seamless wear, I really love those. Um, a lot of those do come in bundles, so you can get the ones that has a waist trainer that comes with it as well, because uh, Snatch Bands do have bundle packages. So you don't have, so you can get a Faja and you can get a waist trainer as well. You can get a wrap and a Faja. Uh, you can get a seamless garment and a, a Snatch Band uh, wrap. Or a, or a waist trainer or so um now they have the uh the uh three belt waist tra trainers which is full coverage is full coverage of the stomach so it's gonna cover you from top to bottom and a lot of women are um they talk about their uh what they call them fl floopers on the bottom they have the three they have the three belt waist trainers, which is full coverage, which would be really, really well. And sometimes in some of their packages, they actually come with the garment. So you can wear it whenever you want to wear it. You can switch it out. You can do whatever you want to do. That's really just a good combination to actually have. Um.